St. Lucia's male senior cricket team returned from St. Vincent and the Grenadines Wednesday evening after winning the Winnet Island Super 50 Cup, beating Grenada by six wickets in the finals last weekend. The Ministry of Youth Development and Sports, in collaboration with St. Lucia National Cricket Association, held a ceremony in their honour at the Darren Sami Cricket Ground. President of the St. Lucia National Cricket Association, Julian Charles, applauded the players for the focus they maintained in preparation for the tournament. You have worked so hard. I mean, I, I know most of you all from, from youngsters and I've seen how hard you all have worked and you all richly deserve this award. And as I said already, I, I, I wish you all the success in your careers going forward. I have no doubt that all of you there have the potential to become international players or at least be able to make a comfortable living out of playing cricket. So I just want to say that and, and wish you all the very best. Acting Deputy Permanent Secretary in the Ministry of Youth Development and Sports, Dr. Rallis Delair, observed that this youthful cricket team's success will augur well for St. Lucian cricket. I know that St. Lucia has done really well in cricket in the past, but not usually at the senior level. But it is really refreshing to see we, that we have a young senior team. So it means that the future of cricket looks very, very bright for St. Lucia. And I'm really, really proud, you know, to see so many young men on our team. I would like to pledge our ministry's continued support for not just cricket, but sports in general. And with, you know, a victory like this in St. Vincent, we have no choice but to continue investing in our young people, in our sportsmen and women. Team coach Gary Matre expressed pleasure with the team's performance and achievement and had some words of encouragement for their continued progress. So for us, we must remain humble and continue to strive for greatness in every match, every practice, every session. Our success today should fuel our determination to achieve even greater victories in the future. Again, congratulations to everyone involved in this remarkable journey. Let's savor this moment and use it as a stepping stone towards more accomplishments. Keep working hard, stay focused, and continue to believe in yourselves and each other. Together we could, we could accomplish anything. Several players on the squad stayed back in St. Vincent and the Grenadines to participate in the best of the best series from which a squad to represent Windward's Volcanoes in the upcoming regional Super 50. They are Captain Kimani Melius, Tarek Edward, Larry Edward, and MVP of the tournament, Shadrach Descartes. West Indies opener Johnson Charles, who did not play the tournament, is included in the lineup. From the Ministry of Youth Development and Sports, I'm Ryan O'Brien.